Hey folks, how's it going? We're checking out more Friday Night Dinner. Hopefully you guys had a fantastic day. Last episode was wild, man. That dude is banking his boss. That means he cheated on his girlfriend twice, if his girlfriend exists, you know? Uh, Johnny be out there like he's slanging cane around town, I guess. <laughs> Well, Adam is left in the dust, not getting any booty. Cold thing, man. Man, they got the house broken into, and Johnny got the car stolen, dude. Cold thing. Like, why would you leave the keys in the car in the first place? Maybe because it's a business car. That's all I can think of. Maybe he doesn't care about it as much as his, his own car. Or maybe he's just so busy arguing about, like, sleeping with his boss, with his family and all that jazz, he just wasn't really paying attention, and that's how it happened. I don't know. And the neighbor, Jim, why does he have so many fax machines, too? I wonder if it's because he went to Japan. He did mention that he learned Chinese in Japan. And I remember hearing about three, four years back, even though Japan is like this technological powerhouse or what have you, they still use fax machines for a lot of their communication. I'm not sure if that's still the case now in 2021, but I do remember watching something about how they still use fax machines really often. They're really prominent in Japan. And I wonder if that's why he has so many fax machines. I don't know. You know, Jim is just such a weird character, man. You never really know what's going on with him. I wonder if the end of the series is going to turn out that he's a serial killer or something freaking crazy. Because he is definitely odd. He's an odd bird. A funny odd bird, but an odd bird. So, yeah, man. I look forward to jumping into this one. Let's just go ahead and jump into it, folks. We'll talk about it more at the end. Hello, Grandma. Oh, thanks, Dolly. Three hours later. Three days later. Oh, don't forget my yogurts are in the boot. Oh, yes, the yogurts. Grandma, you do know none of us eat yogurts. I know. So why did you buy so many? They were half price. What if we can do with 36 of them? That's some old people lodging oh, right there. Why won't it open? <laughs> For sure. Crazy tits. Gotta get you have that to call deal. Uh, yes. It's Liz, actually. Yeah, crazy tits Liz. I can't dump her. It's her birthday tomorrow. Whose birthday is it? Johnny's incredibly old girlfriend, who's also his boss. Oh, crazy tits. Excellent. <laughs> the boot's stuck, Grandma. Dad will have to do it. Crazy oh, tits. OK, Dolly. She's not old. What? Liz, she's not incredibly old. She's 83. 43. Why don't you take her out dancing? 83. For her birthday. Women love dancing. Yeah, all women love dancing. Ow! When I was younger, before I met Sydney, if a man asked me to dance, somehow I always ended up in bed with them. <laughs> <laughs> nice hello, grandma. Hello, Dolly. Oh, come in. <laughs> Hi, boys. Play it fast and loose. Nothing. Do you like my new style? Oh, it's lovely, Mum. Thank you, Jackie. They're very good there. You should go. I'm okay, thanks. There it is. But they specialise in problem hair. Right, go through now. <laughs> hey, get your rude ass out of here. You're right. Hmm? Hello, Bambidos. A uh, sewer. Ow! What are you doing in there? I'm not in there. <laughs> Why are you drawing fish in a cupboard? <laughs> because that's what you do if you want to get sectioned. What? Got all bloody things screaming in my ear. Da no, my father used to do this years ago. Oh, it's delicious. Hey, why won't you do it outside? Is it? And of course, the Portuguese. In like a shack out there. Been doing it for centuries. Oh, of course, the Portuguese. The Portuguese. Not another text. Who's that? She let him do it. it. Dad, is that the old woman he's seen? Not an old woman. How old is she again? Fifty-three. Uh, no, sixty-three. Forty-three. She's forty-three. <laughs> forty-three. Imagine living through two world wars. You're almost as old as you, Jackie. Oh, thank you, Martin. It's her birthday Hello. tomorrow. We're gonna be going out for dinner. So what are you gonna do about her? Where's my sherry? All right, Mum. Behind me. Adam, get Grandma a sherry. Oh, always me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I told him he should just take her out dancing. <laughs> Did you, Mum? It's not quite as easy as that, Grandma. Yes, it is. I'll show you. What? How to dance. Come on. Grandma, oh, you're not going to show me. Yes, just a little dance. What a wonderful idea. <laughs> oh, go on, Johnny. Have a little this dance go with your grandma. Go on. I'll make her happy. Where's the music? Uh, there's a radio machine in the kitchen. Radio machine. So, that's what you should do. You should take your girlfriend out dancing. Agreed. OK, Grandma, I'll do that. And then you bring her back home and make passionate love to her all night. <laughs> No. Take that grandma oh, advice. Just let that seep in a bit. Should be okay. Thanks, Dad. Any uh, Dad, females? Please. Well, your brother's got a female. Correction, old woman. Well, you can learn a lot from an older lady. What, like how to dance to the news? <laughs> Look, <laughs> all I'm saying is maybe you should consider <laughs> other options. Ass. Other options? Like, I don't know. A car girl? Divorcees. Sorry? Or widows. Widows? Yes. OK, I'm going to go inside now and set myself on fire. 
Definitely not on the roof. Down, Down the bro. bedrooms. And the loose. Nothing. I'll call you back. So what are we going to do? Oh, that must be her coming, Mummy. Well, just wanted to let you know, your car appears to be making a terrible moaning noise. OK, well, thanks, Jim. It's, it's almost as if it could talk. Oh, they, is it going to click for them yet? It's Give okay, Mum. You are such an idiot, Martin. It's okay, I can just drill into it. <laughs> what? And drill right into my mother's skull? No, you don't. What? Johnny, call the locksmith. The locksmith? Oh yeah, the locksmith. I know. I'll just Google it, you div. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy tits. You could always call Mike. Jim, please, it's an emergency. It's Mike Sullivan. He's a locksmith. What? He's a friend of mine. Mike Sullivan will get your mother out in no time. Really? Well, call him quick. It's all right, Mum. Unfortunately, I don't have his number because Wilson sort of did something to my phone with his bot. He Wilson. doesn't live far. I know the way. Right, come on. How about this? You think this picket is dangerous? He's going to get you out in one minute. It's so dark. Just try to keep breathing. Ah. <laughs> Friggin' dink. I'm a town planner. Are you? Yes. I thought you were a locksmith. Why? The locks. Oh my Why God, aren't bro. you a shitting locksmith? <laughs> OK, I'm slamming the door now. Uh, um, something's happened. Are they towing the car, bro? 220 bloody pounds. I knew I should have used that hammer. You all right now, Mum? Yes. This is a very fashionable restaurant. Um, she's drunk. Oh, not now. Yes, not now. Am I going in the boot again? Only if you ask nicely. <laughs> One minute. What? I did turn the oven off. Oh, shit. Oh. <coughs> Adam, open the back door. Johnny, take Grandma upstairs. All right. Oh, oh Martin, get the chicken out. What? The chicken! <coughs> oh, 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 shit on the bloody thing! Yes, shit on the bloody thing. Oh, my God. Well, she's outside. What? Oh, She's shit. outside. She's outside. She's outside. This lady's a lunatic. Oh, please don't say it's true. It's true. <laughs> what are you do? He's so don't happy. Don't worry, Johnny. Just talk to her like a it's man. It's true. Yeah, like a really old man. She understands you then. Shut, <laughs> shut up. Shut up. She's coming up the drive. Just tell her how you feel. Suicidal. Yeah, you were going to go around and talk to her a second ago. Getting closer. That was before. This is now. I can't just talk to her. About to press the doorbell. Please. Doorbell press. Oh, God. And let the agony begin. <laughs> Hey, Johnny, it's okay. Don't worry. Calm down, it'll be fine. It won't be fine. Shit, shit, shit. Martin, go and put your shirt on. Just go on, Johnny. Okay, I can do it. I can do it. No, I can't do it. I've got to hide. Hide? Yes, hide. Come in. You can't. Oh, I'm so sorry. I appear to be in your way. Adam. Mum, open the door. Open the door. Out the way. I want to hide. Don't be so stupid. Opening it now. Oh, oh, fish. oh Christ, it stinks. Enjoy. Well, tell her how to go away. Jim, what are you doing in there? Come here. Oh, 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 There's a little <laughs> sore. Sorry, Dad. He is losing it. Hello. Oh, hi. I'm Liz. Of course, Liz. Sorry to come round like this, but is Johnny in? Oh, poor um, lady. What? Well. He was, but... Oh, shitting fish! <laughs> well... Cold-blooded. Do you like my hair? Um, it's very short. Don't you like it? Yeah. No, it's... Oh, God. Do you think it makes me look like a man? <laughs> of course not. Oh, no. Don't be silly, love. <laughs> I knew I shouldn't have cut it myself. It's too short, isn't it? It is a bit short. Martin. No, it's lovely. No. Really... Different. It kind of looks like his haircut. Can I just get something from there? What? <laughs> oh! One second. 
<laughs> no, this is back there. One second. Actually, your hair is particularly short. What am I going to do? She definitely looks like a man. Shut up, Adam. <laughs> Mum, I don't want to see her anymore. I don't think I've ever met anyone who's cut their own hair. Martin, why don't you go and finish the washing up? Yes, my little Reichsfuhrer. Johnny, shall we...? Hello. Oh, hi, Grandma. Um, this is... Got a visitor. Jesus. OK. And what is your name, young lady? Liz. Lips. <laughs> what a lovely girl. Hello, Grandma. Uh, have you met Johnny's girlfriend? Yes. Yes. She's a girl. Well, she was the last time I checked. Ah. Maybe you two would uh, like to have a quiet chat somewhere. Um... Yes. Good idea. Johnny? I'm sorry, it's not you, it's me. Well, it is me, but it's also you. What, what I mean is I like you. I really like you. And I work with you, well, for you. And that's not awkward. That's great. It's really great. And you're older than me. Quite a bit older, actually. But you're not too old. No, but you are older and Jesus you've got Christ, a bread bro. maker and stuff. But that doesn't mean anything, because, you know, I like bread. I really like bread. And I like toast. I love toast. Really. Don't I, Mum? Don't I? <laughs> Mommy? This is terrible. Um, Johnny, what are you trying to say? I'm sorry, but I don't want to go out with you anymore. Mm. Oh no, bro! <laughs> oh, this so is terrible. <laughs> oh shit! Come on, love. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going. Stop it. Stop what? Open the door. What door? Just open the door. Seriously, Adam. Like, don't play I'll a girl you. up on your wall. I'll bite you. I'll bite you, Dad, and I will bite you. Give me my keys. Pardon me? My keys. I want to go home. Give me my keys. Do you mean these? Bastard! Ow! Just give them to me, you bloody piece of bloody shit! <laughs> they won't reach. You'll have to come in and get them. Open the door! I can't at oh, the moment. God. You'll have to come in through the side. Through the kitchen! Is it? This is in the kitchen! Is she? I hate you so bloody much! <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> you find someone it's else? They're so shitty to each other. Yeah. What do you think, Adam? Of course you will. Johnny! Um... Oh, my God. Me. <laughs> Sorry, I just, um... He's making it so much worse. Get my fucking keys! Get my fucking keys! Oh, boy! John! Johnny! Oh, Johnny! Oh, Johnny! What? Oh, you stupid oh. friends! You can't! You get a hat! Stop it! Stop <laughs> it! <laughs> oh, no, they would make this shit so much worse for this lady. This man is crazy. Young man. Oh, God. Would you like a yogurt? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> that was probably the worst night of that lady's life. <laughs> oh, no, they're bogus, dude. That is cold blooded. I love how happy Adam was the entire thing. <laughs> the entire time. This causes more chaos. Fantastic. Usually Johnny, for the most part, has the upper hand with a lot of the pranks and stuff like that. He usually gets Adam pretty good. This is a good one on, on uh This is a good one on Johnny. Adam really did uh control the situation pretty good to make him uh to make him a lot more miserable. It ended with all them laughing, it's great. It's similar to the episode where they were talking crap about the lady with the giant cans, and I think she was driving a BMW or something, when all of them were, like, laughing at the end. I think he ran to the back of the car. I can't quite remember. I think that's what happened. Yeah, I think he ran to the back of the car, and the dad was the only one who wasn't laughing, but everybody else thought it was funny. But, dude, this was fantastic. This is this is a really good episode. This is very funny, man. Uh, Jim's out of control. Why would you expect a locksmith because they have a lot of locks? <laughs> I just think they're paranoid. Oh, this dude is so odd. There wasn't a lot of gym in this one, though. It was only for, what, well, he's in probably maybe five minutes of this episode. Man, dude, Martin's out of control. I don't know anything about drying fish, but I want to dry out of my house. <laughs> I do know fish stinks. I kind of figured they were going to get the car towed because when they parked, I saw that yellow line. And I was like, 
they're probably going to tow this car. I think that's what's going to happen to make things a lot worse, you know? I think it's been a while since they mentioned Johnny's girlfriend, his actual girlfriend. So did he break up with her at some point and I just missed it? Because they haven't brought her up. Even just making out the chick on the side of the house, they didn't mention anything about his girlfriend. And now this chick he's dating calling her his girlfriend. And they don't even mention the other chick they were supposed to meet all those times. So maybe he broke up with her and it's just never going to be brought up. And maybe he hasn't been cheating on her at all. I don't know. That poor lady. Why would she cut her hair? And her haircut kind of looked like Johnny's, which is very weird. <laughs> oh, dude. What a terrible time for her. Man, this is a good episode. All right, folks, man. That is it. That is all for this one. Hopefully, you guys are happy, safe, and healthy. I'll see you in the next one. Later.